What if I told you the first criminal caught using fingerprints happened over 120 years ago? No CCTV, no DNA, just a tiny little print on a window seat. This is how fingerprints changed the world of forensic science forever. Forensic dermatographics is the study of rich patterns on our fingers, palms and soles and how they are used in criminal investigations. Your fingerprints are unique even if you are an identical twin. Once formed in the womb, your fingerprints never change. In Chicago, 1910, it made its first history in the world with solving the case through fingerprints evidence only. The case Thomas Jennings. If you don't know about it, let me take you through it. So, he broke into the house and shot the homeowner. While escaping, he touched a freshly painted railing living behind the perfect trees. Police marched it to the Jennings and the court accepted. After accepting the fingerprint as an evidence, he was convinced of murdering the homeowner. This is how fingerprints change the world of forensic science. So, how do we leave fingerprints? Our skin constantly releases sweat and oils from the tips or ridges we can see. When we touch a surface, those trace materials form a print. These are called latent fingerprints. Invisible until revealed with powder, light or chemicals like iodine fuming. Did you know koalas have fingerprints nearly identical to humans? Or fingerprints can survive on a surface if remain unchanged for years. Even cooler, your fingerprints can reveal things like drugs and handling explosives. Fingerprints may be tiny, but in forensics they are mighty. From dusty smudges to full-blown convictions, fingerprints continue to solve crimes in everyday life. If you love this fact-filled deep dive, follow for more insights on everyday forensic science.